What is up guys? So today we're going to do a guide on the Viridian Sharp Talon Mount. Uh, pretty cool looking mount. Alright, let's get started. So the first thing you will need to do is go to Dalaran right here on the map. And talk to this vendor just outside. And pick up some dried bilberries. The next thing you will need to do is fly to Valishar. And right there on the map is a world quest. This world quest will have to be up for you to continue. Once there, you will have to find the Sharp Talon Matriarch. And you can see the Tom Tom coordinates right there. You will need to kill the Matriarch. Upon doing so, an orphaned hatchling will appear just up top of this hill here. Run or fly up over this little knoll here and you will find an orphan hatchling. The orphan is located right here on the map, just to be clear. Next, you will right-click on the hatchling and feed him the dried bilberries that you picked up in Dalaran. After doing so, you will get this as a battle pet. Once you have him as a battle pet, you will be able to summon him, and you will get a quest to raise him to level 25. You can choose to level your pet the old-fashioned way, however, the longer it takes you to level your pet, the longer it will take you to obtain your mount. The fastest way I found to level the pet is to head to Dalaran right there on the map and talk to the battle pet master. In this tab, you will find flawless battle stones that you can purchase for three pet charms each that will cost you 72 in total because you will need 24 and you can simply use those to level the pet quickly. Once your pet reaches level 25 simply complete the quest right there and your pet will then sleep for the rest of the day. Your pet's quest will reset as daily quests reset. Um, the next quest you will get will be to bring your pet to a major city. Now, if you guys are familiar with Children's Week and the orphans that you have to take around and complete quests with, it, this is about the same thing. Your pet must be out before you can complete the quest. Each day you summon your pet, you will get a new quest. There will be 15 quests in total before you will be able to get them out. Some quests will be to kill a certain type of battle pet with your orphaned battle pet. Some quests will require that you complete a world quest or even kill a raid boss or dungeon boss. There have been some changes since the last patch. There are now 10 quests and you can use your alts to complete them. Um, so if you have alts, you can go in and complete each quest and drastically reduce the time before you can get your mount. Once you have completed the quest line you will then summon your pet and you will have a quest to return to the world quest location. Once you return back to the world quest location right there on the map simply run up over that grassy knoll where you found the orphan before you will find a matriarch laying there on the ground. Uh, simply right click and bandage her up and complete the quest. Upon completing the quest, the mount will be put into your bag, and congratulations on the mount. If you guys found this guide to be helpful, um, remember to like it. Also, subscribe if you haven't for more great content like this. And if you guys have any questions or concerns, please leave them in the comments below.